Welcome back to Good Morning Maine. I'm here with Siobhan Riggler. She is the Director of Development and Public Relations for Bangor Public Library. Thank you for joining us this morning. Sure. And she's here to talk about a cool Earth Day event that's coming up. It's a arts and crafts supply swap. Mm -hmm. Siobhan, can you tell us a little bit about this event? Sure. It's happening on Earth Day from 10 to 7. Anyone can come in. Um, and try out, collect some new arts and crafts supply. Mm -hmm. You can definitely donate some, but you don't have to take any if you don't right. want to take any back. Oh, nice. So it's free to the public. Mm -hmm. Yeah, cool. Mm -hmm. I know personally I have a lot of arts and crafts supplies <laughs> that I don't want to throw away, right. but I, I don't really know what to do with. I'm probably not doing those projects anymore because mm -hmm. artsy people sometimes they hyper fixate on certain projects and they move on to the next one and they have all sorts of stuff left over. That's so true. We see people with half started projects or projects <laughs> they just don't want to deal with anymore and they get real joy passing it on to somebody else yeah. um, so that's why this has become very popular yep. so it seems like maybe adults and kids could benefit from this swap definitely we have a lot of families come in that um, want to maybe their child wants to start crocheting or yeah. knitting and you know it's nice to get them started on that and then kids are very imaginative yep. so they see <laughs> these supplies and they I hear them say oh we could do this with that and so it's fun yeah. to see what they think of what a creative thing to do to celebrate Earth Day too, mm -hmm. because like I said, otherwise mm -hmm. this stuff would might end up in the landfill. Right, because sometimes you just have a few things and people don't think it's worth to, um, sending it to their favorite charity shop. Right. So this is a great way for people to just take a few things of something. Amazing, mm -hmm. okay, so you said on Earth Day, is that a Monday? It is a Monday, Okay. Yes. From 10 to seven? 10 to seven, so if you can't make it during the day, definitely come um, after work or after whatever you're doing during the day. and. We're limiting people in the early hours to two bags because okay. we have a lot of stuff, but sometimes people get enthusiastic. But after <laughs> four, it's take whatever you want. Nice. So if you want to try a lot of things, you can do it. Good system. Mm -hmm. And um, any other upcoming events? So on that day, the Friends of the Bangor Public Library are also doing a pop-up book sale. So Ooh. this is smaller than their normal book sale, but everything is um, one to two dollars, and the same thing applies. If you come after four, you might get some special deals. Wow, that is a good deal. Mm -hmm. I love a good book sale. Yes. Cool. Mm -hmm. And I saw this event on Facebook, right? So people yes. can um, check it out on Facebook to learn more? Right, if you follow us on Facebook, you can see all of the events coming up, and you can put yourself down as interested, and you'll get a reminder um, when it's happening. Yep. Mm -hmm. Easy enough. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> Siobhan, that's all. Um, mm -hmm. Thank you very much for joining us. Thank you for having us. Of course. We'll send it over to Devin Biggs for our full weather forecast.